Sinatra. You know, while most of us would probably describe lobstering as a profession, there is one Mainer, Steve, who prefers to describe <laughs> it as art. Yes, and his name is Andrew Cook of Hollis, and he has developed a very popular line of made in Maine drawings under the title, Lobstering is an Art. Just make sure you take a very close look at each lobster. I always start with the same basic shape of uh, the lobster that I, I created, uh, you know, years ago. But while Andrew Cook's lobsters may all start the same, it's a whole different picture once they're finished. So if you're looking at it from far away, you're like lobster, but when you get up real close, you're like, wait a minute. Upon that closer look. This is my uh, main course, lobster course at Lobster Valley East. You'll find one of many dozen different designs that Cook has dreamed up over the past four years. From buoys to sea glass, even a map of New York City's subway system, each of his basic lobsters eventually takes on a whimsical life of its own. That's the, that's the cool thing about being an artist is there are no uh, limitations to what you want to do. While drawing is Cook's passion, there is a flip side to his creations. It's the contributions he makes to the lobster industry. Much of his work, even profits, are donated to various organizations, including the Maine Lobstermen's Association. A lifelong Mainer and consumer of lobster, it's a way to give back, he says. I always felt like the lobstermen didn't get enough recognition um, for the, the work that they do. Um, that, you know, they don't crawl out of the ocean and onto your plate. Safe to say, nothing says Maine like the iconic lobster and its one-of-a-kind shape you can easily spot from a good distance away. But to truly appreciate Andrew Cook's work, you'll want to move in for a much closer look. A lot of people love lobster, but they also love something else. So to bring a unique hybrid of two things together uh, can kind of tell a story and, and spark a, you know, a time when they were here in Maine. Now take a look at this. Uh, here is the finished peach uh, piece, which we saw Andrew working on while we were there shooting in his studio. It is a tribute to first responders and the work they do saving lives. But check out the yeah. very <laughs> bottom of the lobster tail. To our surprise, he added the Channel 8 news crew on the scene. That is some good stuff. And is that you, Steve? Would well, that be you down there? How many of us have gray hair in the newsroom? Uh, not me yet. I've been coloring it so long, I'm not sure. So I think uh, <laughs> I love it. That's great. Look great.